And good evening, everybody. We begin our newscast with breaking news tonight out of Manoa. The massive boulder landed on an eye of a home in Manoa Hillside Estates just feet away from crashing into the house. Elisa Revlo joins us live from Manoa with more. Elisa. Hey guys, yeah, the homeowner tells me he heard a loud boom, thought it was an explosion, so you can imagine his surprise when he came out here, saw this huge boulder in his backyard, and check this out. He tells me he was watching TV in his back room, which is literally just steps away right over here. Um, now, I want you guys to walk with me over here so I can show you the path of this boulder. This call came in around 645 this evening. Take a look over here. It appears the boulder came rolling down the mountain, landed probably in this neighbor's backyard, came crashing through this fence, caused so much damage. You can see over here, it crushed some trees, actually didn't damage any of these pots right here, and then it landed right here in the neighbor's backyard. Now, luckily, no one was hurt, but it did cause some damage to the house. You can see there's a hole right here in this awning, and it also caused some damage to a roof. We're also told some smaller boulders took out an AC unit at the neighbor's house. Here's what the homeowners had to say. I thought he was joking because he's a jokester, and he said, um, there's a boulder in our lanai, and I've never had boulders falling from the ridge, so we're hoping the fire department can help us on all the neighbors determine whether this is, you know, a safety issue for all the homes here. It could be worse, but now it's just uh, <laughs> trying to figure out what to do with this thing. Now, firefighters came to patch up the roof on the house, and neighbors have been stopping by all night to check out the rock because they are just in disbelief. They can't believe this happened. Now, the homeowners tell me the next step is trying to figure out how to get this thing out of here, but in the meantime, they're just happy no one was hurt. Howard and Marissa, send it back to you guys in the studio. Elisa, thank you. Now, this isn't the first time something like this has happened. In 2013, a 150 pound boulder came crashing down a hillside in Kalihi Valley, landing on Kula Kolea Place. Or just a year earlier, massive boulders, one the size of a car, damaged three homes. In 2011, a boulder about half the size of a car crashed into a shed on 10th Avenue in Palolo. In 2007, boulders came down in Hawaii Kai and Lani Kai, causing damage. In all of those cases, no one was injured. But in 2002, a boulder came down in Nu'uanu, killing 26-year-old Dara Onishi while she was sleeping.